how do I balance the need to move to the cloud with the need to reduce cost? Now, one of the things that we have in our IT departments is that we are under pressure to reduce cost. We're also getting pressured to move to the cloud. And as some people have asked, hey, guess what? Sometimes when I move to the cloud, my costs go up. How, how, do, we, how do we fight that tension? Well, the first thing is, is we don't move everything all at once. We need to learn about how the cloud operates and how it, and, and how it costs us money, right? So the first thing that we do is we can either take a look at an existing pro project that we have that may be hard to maintain on premise, but that there's tools in the cloud that are gonna help us, and we can move that, and we can look and see what, what impact that has on our budgets. We can look and see what it's gonna cost us versus the effectiveness that we gain. Or we start with a greenfield project, something that we can move to a service that's consumption-based, maybe not based on virtual machines and, and our, our former processes of how we would deploy things. We could go to functions as a service, or we could go to containers and take advantage of some of the, the built-in scale that's provided there that allow us to scale up on demand and only pay for what we're using. As we start, as we start to do that, we're going to gain a familiarity with how the cloud operates and how the cloud bills us. And from there, we can build a plan to migrate existing services. And we're gonna to start to find out which services we are actually getting the biggest bang for our buck is. Through that, you'll start to build that comfort level. You'll be ready to move the next services.